the stomach is where the heart should be. Plus she's pregnant. So we got a, a diaphragmatic hernia. Mixie has a condition we call diaphragmatic hernia. That's where there's a hole inside the diaphragm. So basically all of the abdominal contents being sucked up through this hole where the lungs are. With Missy being pregnant, we have some babies that are pushing up against this area too. It's almost like this cat is being slowly suffocated to death. All right, my friend, we got a diaphragmatic hernia. A stomach is in our intestines. That's why the cat's breathing like this. I don't know if I'm being to save the babies. I don't know if I'm being to save mom. Somehow I gotta get the kittens out, remove the stomach, tie the diaphragm back, you know, and breathe for her the whole time and hope she pulls through. These kittens are growing, and the more they grow, the less room there's gonna be for mom's lungs expand. If we don't give this a try, this cat is surely gonna die, along with these kittens. It's a tough job. Prognosis is guarded, but give it everything I got. Yes, sir. All right? I believe in. No doubt. I appreciate it, man. All right, man. We'll be back. This is going to be an incredibly risky surgery. My game plan here is to get those kittens out as fast as I can. Then I got to remove those stomach contents as well as the intestines out of the chest cavity. Then I got to repair the diaphragm and the hernia. If all that goes great, then I got to reinflate those lungs. So the best case scenario is I'm able to save mom. Worst case scenario is kind of the obvious. Do some magic here. All right, baby's going to come out quick. All right, here we go. The uterine horn is actually in the chest. Oh, boy. Oh, wow. All right, there's your kittens. Thank you, man. The uterus was actually in the chest cavity. So I don't know if those kittens are viable or not. Good gracious, we got a huge hole. Intestines all in there. How are we looking? It's not bad. The guy loves his cat, though. He's like, man, I just tell him I'm do everything I can to save the cat. Doc, what you got out there? Some of them are taking breasts every now and then. The lungs aren't fully developed. I'm curious, like, how, did, how does this happen? Is this like trauma or? That's my thought. So I'm actually trying to close the diaphragm. Come on, cat, hang in there now. Now I gotta reinflate the lungs. It's real hard now. Good, good. Yeah. All right, turn it off. All right, boss. Let's keep our fingers crossed. We see some inflated lungs. And maybe we might have our miracle, brother. So we'll go shoot the x-ray and see. We need to visually make sure that these lungs have inflated. If they have, then we got a decent shot here. If they haven't, then we got a real big problem. Got some? No <sighs> like lungs to me. Yes, yes, yes. yes. All right, can I get off the table? Yeah. All right. These lungs have started to reinflate. And his diaphragmatic hernia is repaired, but this is definitely not out of the woods yet. This is what the lungs look like. I mean, it's babies, intestine, just bad. Here, you can see air, lungs. You can see my diaphragm closed. Everything's on the backside. It's a miracle that Mrs. surgery went as well as it did, but unfortunately, her babies are another story. How viable they look. They struggling. Still breathing? Yeah, oh, this one's the largest. And he seems to be doing okay. Doing better than the others. Yeah, pretty young. We were able to remove these kittens, but unfortunately, looking at them, they're quite premature. However, it was very important that we uh, remove these kittens, or mom wouldn't have had a chance to survive. The prognosis for these kittens is extremely guarded. Yes. Mm. We ain't giving up. How we doing here, man? Doing good. Everything, SPL2, look way better. Her heart is normal. She taking breaths. So far, so good. How you feel? Just cold, huh? Hey. Yeah, that's why I was put it in there. Hey. You see? She's hey. up. Yeah. I just got to warm you up now. So I can feel your heart. You breathing on your own. I'm definitely pleased with everything so far, but, you know, it's still going to be guarded for the next 24, 48 hours. 